Hi, my name is Sokintari Sway, and I'm speaking to you from Forest Hills, Queens, in New York City. Uh, right now, I'm sitting on my porch. It is screened, and I'm enjoying this quarantine Sunday with my quarantine juice. It's nice to have people in your life who can take care of you like that. I've done this video many times now. One time, several times I had makeup on and then I realized that's just not really me right now um, because that doesn't bring me joy. If we're gonna Marie Kondo it, my hair is growing out. Estheticians have lost their jobs and lots of men and women have hair in places that we see and don't see. So, you know, let's just be real about it. Freckles in full glory. In the meantime, I really like to tell you about a few organizations that I would love for you to support because, you know, everybody's struggling right now, but especially the nonprofits. So since I'm wearing the shirt, let's just say the Bronx Documentary Center, right, BBC, um, which is a sort of self-explanatory, but they're a terrific uh, organization in the South Bronx and they do all this wonderful work. In addition, they also have a photography program for, for um, young people. Um, and then three organizations dear to my heart that have to do with the Cambodian American community here. The first I helped co-found called CLA, uh, Cambodian American Literary Arts Association. It's now based in Lowell, Massachusetts, helping the second largest Cambodian American population. Um, the other is Cage Empowering, Cambodian American Girls Empowering, based in Philly. And, and they do a lot of work around providing a space for arts and culture of the of the young diaspora. Sorry, our dog is over here. And the last is Mekong NYC, based in the Bronx, helping. It's an, uh, an activist organization that uh, uh, their constituents are the Southeast Asian community in the Bronx, and they are especially vocal right now about uh, the issues of deportation in our people's community. So uh, the links will be available, and I do hope that you can choose to help one or more than one, whatever you can afford and are willing to, to do. As far as uh, self-care and things that get me through these days, it, thinking about the projects that I have been a part of, <laughs> like Cambodian, sorry, the, the dog is being zoomed in on, uh, like Cambodian rock band, uh, for which I was the Khmer language consultant. And I spend a lot of time thinking about Cambodian language as someone who's coming back to it as a 1.5 generation. And so I guess for now, I would like to sing you one of the songs that was on the show um, that I helped teach to one of the actors. So um, I didn't rehearse this. So. Chnam on the pramoy Chnam on the pramoy Clean brewy line She was good to clean grooms La 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 There's another verse. I don't feel like doing it. Um, we don't know how long this pandemic will be, but I hope that wherever you are, you are practicing safe measures to protect those around you. And um, I think that's it for now. So goodbye from Forest Hills here with with our pup Srey Samnang. That means uh, lucky girl in Cambodia, right girl? Thanks for being here with me.